All right, I gotta get this one right because I'm almost done with this fucking beer. What's going on guys? It's Morris Mode from It's a Guy Thing. And I wanna do a real quick video, real quick. Real quick, real quick, real quick. Um, to talk about the uh, sort of the situation that we're in. Um, I'm sure you guys seen the supermarkets and the fucking Walmarts and shit. It's bad. Um, on a Saturday, I went out I had to go to five different stores. I mean, I don't know what that matters, but I spent I spent about 200 bucks and I bought me enough food to last me at least two weeks. Now, I'm still going to go out this week, upcoming weekend, probably buy some more. But as it stands now, if everything fucking shuts down, I'm good for two weeks. Um... You have a lot of people out there going fucking crazy over toilet paper. The fight over toilet paper that went viral around the world. I just want one pack. No, not one pack. Like, they take 186 shits a day. Now, I don't take 186 shits a day, so I feel like I have enough toilet paper. Because toilet paper is one of them, one of these things that, like, no matter what, whenever you go to the grocery store and on a weekly basis, you always pick up toilet paper. So I want to say, I at least have enough toilet paper to get me through two weeks. I mean, I've got, well, I mean, I bought an, an extra, extra one, but just your normal, typical family size um, little thing of toilet paper. Um, yeah, so... I believe I'm good on this. Here's what you motherfuckers really need to be worried about. You need you motherfuckers need to worry about getting sick. Not fucking shitting 186 times a day. So what me and my wife did, we get stocked up on some Alka Seltzer, cold and flu. Because if this thing hits you, you're getting sick. So get some fucking medicine. Also, if you got kids, get your kids some fucking vitamins. They should already be taking them, but if, and if they are, you need to go ahead and just buy another thing just in case. Another thing, fucking Gatorade, Powerade, whatever the fuck this is, you're going to need some electrolytes. You're going to need to stay hydrated. So... Water, yeah, you still need water. You don't need the whole goddamn Walmart aisle of water, but you still need water. But you also need to throw some electrolytes in there too, especially if you get sick. We're not, uh, 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 well, now we're kind of prepping for, you know, um, what is it, people. But the problem is still a virus. So if you get sick, you're going to want to take care of yourself. You're going to want vitamin C. And one thing that I forgot to bring out, be right back. Get you some vitamin C supplements. You take one of these once a day. Build your immune system up. Vitamin D, build your immune system up. Um, what else we got here? Oh, yeah. Um, ibuprofen seems to just make shit worse. I'm not a name brand kind of guy. But you're going to need acetaminophen, which would be Tylenol, name, name brand. But acetaminophen. Now, I, feel, I felt like 100 caplets would do me fine because I already have some Tylenol already opened. Because I take it when I get a headache because I'm a normal human being. But as a, as a precaution, just got a little extra one. Fever reducer. Um... That being said, with all the fucking idiots out there destroying everything, 
take it like the fucking Walmart is done. The fucking grocery stores are done. The last thing we really want to talk about, and Mike, Mike will agree, huh? is people's going to start getting savage. We've already seen their complete lack of, of humanity in their hearts by not thinking about the next person behind them. They have to grab all 48 family-sized paper towels, toilet papers that they see on the shelves. So they don't give a fuck about you. No, no toilet paper. We already see that. So. Come and get me, motherfucker. That's what you got to worry about. You're going to have to worry about people now. So stay armed. Stay safe. What else we got here? Um, you're going to need some knives. It's, I mean, you can fish. This isn't really a filleting knife, but you're going to have to, um, me, I'm going to, I'm going to stock up on some fish, but you're going to need some knives that can do whatever you need them to do. And uh, a fucking box cutter or a pocket knife is not going to be what you need. Um, that's my suggestion, which, um, probably within the next few days, I'm going to go out there and I'm going to completely stock my, uh, fridge up with whatever I catch, which probably the easiest will be bass. I'm not too fond of bass, but at least it will be food and it will be protein and it will be vitamin D in my system. And I don't have to go to the store and fucking buy it. So... Um, yeah, I think that's about it. I think that's everything uh, I've got to say. Um, so, to everybody watching, uh, to, every, to, to the whole uh, It's a Guy Thing fan club, nation, whatever you guys want to call, yourself, call yourselves, uh, please stay safe. Think about your fellow humans, your fellow human beings out there that's pregnant who's got kids, they need the same shit that you need. You don't need to buy a fucking month's worth or a year's worth of shit for what's going on right now, which is the fucking flu. It's just a flu we've never seen before. So you motherfuckers, fuck off. To everyone else, stay safe. Think about your fellow man. Do what you gotta do. Get what you need to get, but make sure that you leave some for the rest. Peace out, guys. Be safe. Buster, what are you doing? <sighs> What's going on, guys? It's more smooth with this the guy thing. And I'm here to help you out in these trying times that we're living in right now. Seems we have a bunch of fucking idiots out there taking all the fucking toilet paper. And I don't even understand why. I'm going to redo this. Hold on. You know, um, <laughs> hold on. All right. Take 482. The meat. I don't know what size deep freezers some of these guys have, but all you're doing is, fuck man, god damn.